Shohei Otani just signed the craziest franchise contract of all time with the Dodgers. And to celebrate him signing such a historic contract, I'm restarting his career. But the reason why we're going back in time all the way to 2018 is to see what would have happened if he picked the Dodgers originally. And here we are, the 2018 Dodgers team. You got Clayton Kershaw and Kenley Jansen at 99 overalls. You got a 38-year-old Rich Hill at 91. You got 23-year-old starting pitcher Shohei Otani. Shohei, you got a lot of hype. Let's get this thing going. Let's see how he does. I wish it was that easy, but of course there are challenges for Shohei Otani. And for the first five seasons of his career, he has season challenges. We'll get into those later, but for season one, he's got to pitch below a 3.5 on his ERA and win the rookie of the year. We're coming up on the end of Shohei Otani's rookie season and the Dodgers finish off 89 and 73. They couldn't even win the NL West. What what happened? Yo, the Giants actually beat them up. What the? 95 and 67. We for sure underperformed as now Otani is the ace of this team. How did he do? We're looking for below a 3.5 and that rookie of the year. How we doing, Shohei? 7 and 15 with a 4.2. That is not what we're looking for, dude. If I had a bet, there's no way he got the rookie of the year. And yeah, Freddie Peralta just wiped the floor with him. Let's hope that we can do good in the wild card game. Shohei, it's all you. And he got absolutely pieced up. You hate to see it. Shohei failed both of his rookie season challenges. He didn't pitch below a 3.5 and he didn't win the rookie of the year. Now we got to pick a consequence for next year. So Shohei, what the heck was that? What do we got? Number three, start the first month in AAA. Now on LB19 in year two, Shohei, you're looking good still in 87 overall, but we got to move you down to AAA. Otani, how are you going to do for your first AAA debut? Not bad at all, but we still lost. That's unfortunate. Let's hope for a good month. Let's see how he does by the end of it. And here we are, May 1st. Otani, how are we looking? Real quick. Oh, there we go. Dealing. Hopefully that's good enough to bring his confidence back up. Otani, let's see how you do in season two. And his second year is going to be a huge year because our season challenge is to stay healthy in all of 2019 because unfortunately for the real life Shohei Otani, he got injured right at the end of 2019. So if we can just stay healthy throughout the entire year, that's going to be a gigantic win for us. And for the second season challenge, he's got to win a silver slugger as a pitcher. This 2019 Dodgers team is looking unstoppable. 111 and 51. Easily taking the division right there. Let's see how everybody did. Offense, of course, disgusting. Oh my gosh, Shohei's on 94 overall. I'm expecting huge things out of Shohei. He definitely did not win the sign award because Clayton's just a cheat code. But Otani, how you doing? There we go. Plus fours and plus fives this year. I love it. I gotta see how we did though as Scooter Jeanette wins the MVP for 2019. I forgot how broken franchise was. Coach, you are out of your mind. Rookie of the year, no players qualified. Bro, why couldn't have we been a rookie in 2019? We would have literally been the only one to win it. So that definitely stinks. All right, hey, Silver Slugger, let's see. Come on, Shohei Otani. There we go. The second season goal winning a Silver Slugger already done and that's his first one of his career but there was one other thing that we had to accomplish and that was staying healthy throughout the entire 2019 season and from here it only shows that he started 26 games typically that means he was injured but luckily rich hill was actually taking a few starts away from him thank goodness by the way because we needed this so desperately let's say we do in the 2019 postseason lds up first versus the rockies what a fever dream this feels like oh my gosh as we easily take that 3-1 now this makes more sense nlcs time versus the braves now and no shot the dodgers about to choke like this again Again. Down 3 1. We got the chance to do something insane. Come on, let's come back. Kenta Maeda, all starts with you. And we got torched by a rookie Max Freed. Sick, dude. On to LB20 now. And this is going to be the first time we get to see Otani actually hit. Because again, as he was injured at the end of 2019, I guess MLB20 just put him in as a batter only. Okay, so our boy's exclusively going to be in the lineup this year. And 2020 was the year that the Dodgers ended up taking a World Series championship. So our goals are pretty simple. Goal one is hit over 20 home runs for the first time ever. And then goal two is help lead the Dodgers to that first World Series championship of Shohei Otani's career. Coming up to the end of 2020, we're looking at a record-breaking season right now. We finished off the year 120 and 42. Obviously, win our division and take it on the winner of the wild card game. I have to know how Otani did for his first year only hitting. Shohei, let us see 20 home runs as you're playing left field out of everything. Mookie Betts was right behind him at 42. Shohei, how about you? 29. Any awards real quick? MVP Clayton Kershaw. Still in it from everybody. Clayton Kershaw also with a Cy Young, of course. And then Pedro. Pedro Baez, delivery man of the year. Where's Shohei? Is he not going to get anything? Tell me Silver Slugger. And nope, he legitimately got nothing. Let's hope for a playoff or hopefully World Series MVP. First, the Phillies up first. Let's go. And we sweep the Phillies in the NLDS. Cubs now. Oh, man. I feel so bad. Never mind. I don't feel bad. Already down 0-2. Julio, come on back. There we go. Clayton, please. There we are. Tony, not a great loss by one. Walker, it's all up to you. There we go. All right, we got to go in. Oh, Tony, here we go. We've worked at 2-2. Let's start this game off high right there. Smack to the opposite field, and we gotta go. That's a home run. Good to see as we take that 2 nothing lead in the NLCS. Let's go. Shohei, let's see them fielding skills. Come on. Let's see it. Let's see it. Beautiful job. And there we are. The Dodgers offense 
absolutely carries this game as we take it six to two and we're going to the world series baby and there's no freaking shot 2020 world series versus the angels you gotta be kidding me playing kershaw versus griffin won that one six to four walker bueller game two won that one as well there we go julio please versus dylan bundy i mean it's too easy game three we gotta sweep him let's go tiny biggest game of his life right here two guys on two outs top of the first how are we gonna do oh my gosh I've seen it a thousand times, but that's not enough power to carry it out. Top of the six tie game. Nobody on base right now. I would love it. They're playing the shift on me. Come on, game. We're not serious with that, but the team takes the lead right there. Let me just blast this thing as that's straight to the shift again. Oh, man. We got one more attempt. Thank goodness. Let's go, show. Hey, wait for it. There it is. That's got to go. There's no way that does it. There it is. Home run in the biggest game of his life versus old team. Absolutely beautiful. Now, let's go win that ring right here. There we go. Shohei Otani officially a World Series champion. Awards real quick and there we go. That's all I wanted to see. Shohei Otani playoff MVP. On to LB21 now and this is the first year that Shohei Otani can finally be a two-way player and like an actual two-way player because now we can put him at DH. The only problem is 2021 the NL doesn't have a DH yet so we're still in a weird part of his career but it's all going to work out pretty soon. Come on fresh off a World Series win in a playoff MVP. All we got to do this year is get invited to the Home Run Derby and get invited to the All-Star Game. Let's hope for a good healthy year from Shohei Otani and let's hope for a fun July real quick. Here we we are july 12th home run derby this is by far going to be the hardest part because again just because he's a two-way player he's not playing all of the games so let's hope he can still get in as no dude daniel vogelbach and reese hoskins got in before him let's at least get the all-star game please show hey come on baby where are you don't tell me he failed both oh my gosh how does this not get you into the all-star game the end of year four and it's another fantastic year for the dodgers and otani 99 and 63 taking our division and taking on the brewers in the nlds awards though gold glove all all right, I'm down for that. That's a gold glove. And then what else? Silver slugger for Justin Turner. Is that it? That can't be the only thing. There we go. Silver slugger for the pitcher. Otani absolutely wipes the freaking floor with every other pitcher here, so I'm happy about it. Now one of the NLDS versus a pretty good Brewers team. So Walker lead us off. One nothing. There we go. That's exactly what we needed. Otani up next versus Brandon Woodruff. Lost that by two. Don't like that at a show, hey? Game three, please. There we go. Barely squeaked that out. And Clayton Kershaw up for game four. My gosh. We're actually going to game five. Thank goodness Walker. Walker Buehler is coming up here, though. Please, first Corbin Burns. What a game. There we go. 13-9. to nine. Way too close out of us, and our bullpen almost gave it up, too. So now we're facing the Giants. Here we go. Carlos right on to the Giants. Otani versus another team he could have gone to. San Francisco. Let's see. Otani, let's go. Game one. Lost that as well. Otani's 0 for 2 in the playoffs. I don't like that at all. But it didn't matter too much, because over the next three games, we end up taking all of them. 3-1. Now Dodgers are way too powerful. Tony Gosselin lost that, though. Shohei Otani, please clinch this. Bring us to the World Series, baby. There we go go 14 to 3 that's what i like to see out of show hey there's no shot back to back are you serious the angels messed up so bad they didn't even get a postseason appearance when shohei otani was there now they're in back to back world series wait does that make shohei the problem i swear walker up first for game one one down six to one otani beat him up plus that by three. Oh my god they scored 10 and over the next three games we take two of them only dropping one bringing us up to a 3-2 lead and i don't care for this game i'm putting otani back in at of course left field because we have to let's go out this time at home and get him back-to-back -back rings. Walker Buehler back on the mound. I believe in him as Shohei. What the heck is this batting stance? It's a Walmart version of Shohei Otani. That is not him. I refuse to believe that's his batting stance in this game. Why did they change it? It didn't need changed as we absolutely sky that thing. I would probably hit the moon and came back down. And of course, the catcher gets it. Let's hope his fielding still good though. As no Walker. No. Two-run home run for a guy that never plays anymore. Anthony Rendon. And they take the lead in the World Series. It's time to lock it back in. And there we go. That is absolutely torched. If that doesn't go over right field, there we go. Home run to tie the game. Had to do it. We had to come up clutch. And Otani was removed for a pinch runner. And now we're on the freaking bench. Oh my gosh. But it doesn't matter as the Dodgers finally beat the Angels, winning our second ring in two years. Already two World Series championships on the resume for Shohei Otani, and he's not even in 2024 yet. Now, before we go into the next game and the next season, we still failed our challenge, unfortunately. We had a nice fun year, but now we got to get a consequence. What's even calling my name, honestly? I think number seven. What do we got? Minus 10 to all hitting attributes? No. Now in LB22, the game that he's literally the cover boy of. And we got one goal. It's not going to be simple, but we got a goal. And that's to win the MVP this year. Let's see how we do. Final week of the season coming up right here as we finish off 117 of 45. Beating the LB win record for the second time this video. Breaking records is nice, but did he complete the season challenge? That's my biggest question. So please, awards. Come on, baby. Evan Phillips delivered man of the year. Shohei Sayang Award. That's pretty nice. That's his first one. 
Tank Earnward going to Shohei MVP. Silver Slugger going to Shohei, but he... No shot. No. Manny Machado just stole the MVP. You're lying. Come on. Shohei easily should have won that. I'm giving it to him. I don't care. That's just the game being stupid. Like, normally I would respect the rankings, but dude, he won the batting title this year, which is given to the highest average, even though they did tie. But he also won the Hank Aaron Award, which is given to the best overall hitter for the league. Not to mention the sign on top of that. He's the MVP. I don't care what anybody says. Fantastic year out of him, though. 41 home runs, 101 RBIs, and a 312. Now it's time for the postseason. First step against the Padres. Manny Machado's team. It's time to get some revenge real quick. Shohei, let's go. Won that one 3-2. to two. Let's go, baby. And the rest of the series went off easy as we take that 3-1. to one. Cardinals up now. Okay, Clayton Kershaw for Steven Matz. Won that one 11-0. Oh, man, this might be an absolute blowout. And my God, it was. Out of four games, the Cardinals only scored two runs. Either the Cardinals are poverty or we got a lot of Mexican supplements. I'm hoping for number two. Guardians now. Shohei Otani for Shane Bieber for game one. Lost that one. Okay, Guardians. Clinton Kershaw. There we go. Beat him up. Game three. Very weird. Won that. There we go. And then Shohei Otani. Come on, baby. Give us a through and lead as he choked it. All right. Tony Gosselin. Okay, guys. Really? We're not about to lose this. Clayton Kershaw, please. There we go. Otani pitch now in game seven. You best believe we're going in for this one. We just got to make sure that we do not mess up here as there we go. Will Smith solo home run. But all Shohei Otani has to do is coast and he'll be onto his third ring in three years. And that's one run scored from Shohei Otani. That's all right, though. Hey, that's fine. He gets out of the jam. Through eight innings, only one run scored. Offense. Let's get it going a little bit, please. Evan Phillips to take it over. Let's please just try to win this right here. That's a good start. Double off of David Peralta. Now, Freddie Freeman. 0 for 3 this game, but he's doing so good. That's a walk. We'll take it. Mookie bets up now. Ground out, but that gets both the guys over. Trace Thompson. I want to pinch it for Shohei Otani, but he's not here. So Trace just win it right here. It's a walk. Base is juice. Never mind. Will Smith. They walk the winning run in a game seven of the World Series, and we take our third win. We get to add another World Series ring, though, to our trophy case. Let's go, Shohei. Back to LB23 and Shohei. Here we go. Coming off of three straight World Series wins, we finally unlock his career goals. And the goals for his career is to double every single trophy that he currently has. And so far, we got three World Series wins, one playoff MVP, one Cy Young, one MVP, one batting title, one Hank Aaron Award, three Silver Sluggers, and one Gold Glove. And we got to double all of that by the time he's done with his contract. And this team keeps on winning 109 and 53. Awards will quit. Okay. All right, Shohei didn't get a single award to start off. That's really not good. Please tell me at least got a silver slugger. He lost to Lourdes Gurriel Jr. Are you kidding me? For the first time in a while, he goes a full year without winning a single award. Why even is that? Please don't tell me the guy's injured, dislocated ankle. He's going to be out for four to five months. There's still a possibility that we can win four straight rings, but it's going to be hard without Shohei. Apparently not that hard though, as we just take the NLCS four to two. Now we're on to our fourth straight World Series, versus the Texas Rangers. Oh, man. Okay, here we go. Glass now. Lost that one. Not a good start. Kershaw versus Nathan Ivaldi. Lost that by the exact same score. Walker Buehler versus John Gray. Won that one. Bobby Miller. Please, Bobby, just come back. There we go. Two to two. Tyler, you're 0 for 2 in the postseason. Please just give me a win or not. Oh, my gosh. Two to three. Clayton, please. Hey, if we have Shohei, we win that easily. Four straight World Series, though. That's very, very good. Let's get Shohei Otani back and healthy, though, for 2024, and let's hope for the best. We're also going to be leaving free agency on auto. So anybody that the Dodgers add to their team is going to be purely from the computer. And of course, how did I know this is going to be just absolutely insane? Cody Bellinger back in LA. Six years, $100 million. I actually don't hate it at all. He had a fantastic year. The band's back together, baby. Let's go for another ring. Shohei, how we feeling? There we go. He's back. He's good and healthy. Dodgers finish off 107 and 55. We got six awards. Oh my gosh. Please let Shohei Otani just mop the floor with everybody. Give my boy his revenge here. Come on. Evan Phillips, the man of the year. Shohei Otani with his second side award. Keep it going. Hank Aaron Award. Let's go at them all. Keep going, Shohei. MVP, Shohei Otani. Second of his career. Shohei Otani with the batting title again. He finally got the triple crown. Oh my gosh. If this doesn't submit him as one of the greatest players of all time, I don't know what will. Oh my god, dude. Who's gonna stop this? 341. 62 home runs at 175 RBIs. Absolute records this year. Let's see if the postseason can go without. Dodgers, you have one of the greatest players of all time on your team. Let's not mess this up. We take the LDS 3-1 and we're off to a very hot start. Now, Braves, let's get it going. Shohei Otani for Spencer Strider. Won that one. Oh, man. And now fast forward in the NLCS. It's now 3-2. Glass now up real quick. Come on, Glass. Lost that by 
Six. All right. Bueller, please. Game seven. There we go. That's what I like to see. Our fifth straight World Series. Shohei Otani, game one versus Kevin Gosman. There we go. Beat him up. Absolutely beat him up. And fast forward the next two games, we take those. It's three nothing already. Let's run it back, Shohei. He's hitting a 365 here, too. Top of the fifth, and the Dodgers have taken a two nothing lead. Let's try to expand that as that's okay. That's not bad. It's a single, but that's not bad. Oh my gosh, this is the moment. Two guys on one out. Just let it happen. We got to wait for that good pitch. Come on, Shotani. There it is. Perfect, perfect. That's the right field. And that's a three run home run to cement it. That should be good enough. Top nine. Yeah, they still haven't scored a single run. The only other guy on this team that is even potentially going to take the postseason MVP away from us is Mookie Betts. So top nine with two outs. This is the opportunity. We have to take this away from him. We got to take this away from Mookie. And there it is. Oh my gosh. Another no doubt home run. And that is the nail in the coffin. It has to be. And there we are. Shohei Otani officially gets his fourth World Series ring and awards. Yes, sir. There it is. World Series MVP Shohei Otani. And of course, he's got to get the playoff. And there it is. He almost completed the gauntlet in his first season back. I told you the revenge was going to be huge. Shohei, let's see what happens. And oh my, this is so stupid. Juan Soto's joining the team too. The end of 2025, we were two wins away from tying the win record. Awards again, please. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, only one, but still. Unfortunately though, Matt Olson went absolutely ballistic and stole all of the other awards from us. Just please tell me we can run it back to the World Series. I want to break the Tom Brady record. I got to do it now. Well, Tiny starting game one of the NLDS and ooh, that is... That's not a good start. Okay, hold on. Now I'm worried. And we're down 0-2. No, Gavin Stone, please. Clutch up. No! We got swept by Matt Olsen and the Braves this year. Don't tell me they're going to take it as the Rangers beat them. Wow. Let's get it going. Let's see how he does. In 2026, the Dodgers won 108 games this year. Juan Soto went absolutely insane. I think he just stole everything from Shohei Otani this year. That's unfortunate. And Shohei, yeah, he, he definitely stole everything. That, oh man. Juan Soto, there it is. Juan Soto MVP, Juan Soto batting title, and triple crown of course hey at least was one of the guys on our team let's go out and try to win this world series and we'll see us again versus the braves let us please just take it as we're down one to three. Oh, tani it's all on your shoulders there we go we live another day glass now please oh my god we're living game seven bobby miller oh my gosh way too close as we're now facing the royals and walker bueller's on the royals by the way game one shohei otani versus walker bueller and we take that four to two beautiful job we split game two and three we're up two one so far shohei otani back up again lost that one to Asa Lacey, really? Tyler Glass now again. There we go. Our fifth World Series ring for Shohei Otani is coming in 2026. In awards, Mookie Betts with the MVP and Mookie Betts with the playoff MVP. Okay. How did he do? Wow. Okay. Otani, definitely a weird down year from him. I'm really hoping that next year he'll be able to get right. At the end of 2027, the Dodgers finish off 102 and 60. Definitely one of their worst performances. And Shohei, how are we doing? He's 92 overall now. Still did great. That makes me nervous. I don't like to see this. Awards will Quick glass now stole the sign ward. That's also not good. Mookie Betts got the gold glove, and then of course Juan Soto back to back MVPs. Luckily, Shohei Otani did get an award though. He got the Silver Slugger for DH this year. Up to one of the NLDS. Oh gosh, no. Game five. Come on, Shohei. There we go. That clutch gene is still in there though. NLCS versus the Braves. Now let's get it going. And we're already up 3-0. Come on. First Kyle Bush, just take it. There we go. Four nothing. Absolute domination from the Dodgers right there. Now on to LA versus LA once again. Otani game one. Versus Reed Detmers. Won that one four to two. Beautiful job. Already 3-0 again. Dodgers take it early 3-0 lead, but unfortunately in the bottom of the first, we give up two. Let's try to bring it back a little bit. Let's keep adding on to the lead. There we go. That's what we needed taking the lead. Oh, Mookie Betts. There it is. A three run home run for Mookie Betts is we got nine runs on the day so far. The bullpen just has to hold it. So please. Otani. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Juan Soto. Juan Soto's on second. Otani up versus Griffin Canning. Pop out. Hate to see that. Oh my God. Diego. Two run home run. And Mookie Betts again. Otani now with two guys on. Struck out. That sucks. Yo, the bullpen is taking care of business, too. Otani again, 12 to 7, top of the ninth. Line out. That sucks. Off to Brian Abreu in the bottom of the ninth. Let's hope that he does not choke this so bad. And after two quick strikeouts, we gotta go in. Here we go, Abreu. Let's get Shohei Otani his sixth World Series win. Got the O2. I'm going fastball outside. There it is. Another World Series win. And now Shohei Otani's rings go on two hands. Awards, what do we got? Ahmed Rosario. Okay. And Juan Soto takes it as well. That's the problem with having good guys on your team. Juan Soto's still an 
everything from Shohei. Oh man, you can tell that Shohei Otani's getting older and older because right now the Dodgers are a wild card team for the first time in a while. 85 overall, no shot. You're only 33, Shohei. Awards, he got nothing. He also had a 4.46 ERA this year. I'm really hoping he can come back a little bit, but if he doesn't, it turns out that he's just a liability on the mound. The Dodgers are just going to purely DH him, and that's not good for the legacy. For now, we got the Padres in the wild card series. Let's hope for the best. Alec Manoa going up game one. One that one. There we go. Bobby Miller. Oh, gosh. All down to Shohei. This is the test right here. Shohei, do you still have it? There we go. He still does. Beautiful job. NLDS time versus the D-backs, and we're already down 0-2. Bobby, please. There we go. Come back a little bit. Shohei. There we are. 2-1. What a fantastic game out of Shohei Otani. Alec Manoa versus Brandon lost that by one 2029 still a wild card team but winning 99 games this year that's a little bit better awards come on Juan Soto don't steal everything again I swear please no MVP come on no my biggest question though how did Shohei Otani do from the pitching side and he's demoted to the bullpen and he almost had a five year array this year wild card series let's see how we do we take game one game two easy sweep on to the NLDS versus the Padres let's get this thing going that's already a quick 2-0 Bobby Miller come on baby there we go NLCS versus the Pirates of all teams. Okay. And of course, that's a quick 3 0. Jack Leiter on the Pirates. Okay. And yeah, that's that's really just unfortunate for all Pirates fans. On to our eighth World Series. Let's try to get our seventh ring. Alec Manoa game one versus the Orioles. Please, Alec. Oh my gosh. Lost the first game. And the next two also were not good as we drop games two and three. Gavin, you're our last hope. Do not let this happen to us. There we go. That's one. Alec, please. No, dude. And in 2030, the Dodgers are finally back. There we are. One. 106 and 56. Awards real quick. Shohei Otani, Hank Aaron Award. It's good to see him doing good, even though he really didn't deserve it. He stole that 100% from Corbin Carroll, but I don't care. But he's 73 overall now. Let's get him that seventh ring because I don't think he's going to be around for much longer. And it'll be a time versus the D-backs. This should go easy. And I spoke too soon. One to two. Don't tell me. Gavin Williams, please. Oh my gosh. And Shohei Otani retires because he can't do it anymore. Are you kidding me? The biggest question though, is he going to be a Hall of Famer, at least in this game's eyes? Let's take a look and and of course they don't. Wow, this game sucks so bad. This game aside, let's get to his awards. He went to the World Series eight times. In those 13 years, he went to the postseason 13 straight times and won six World Series championships. He took home one World Series MVP and two playoff MVPs. The two-way stud took home three sign awards in his career, as well as winning two MVP awards. The guy won two batting titles with three Hank Aaron awards and one triple crown. He also won six Silver Slugger awards in his career and got one gold glove. Personally, he deserves to be in the Hall of fame. He changed baseball forever, so I feel like he deserves it. Tell me what you guys think in the comments, and be sure to go get some absolute fire from the Team RGS store. And if you guys like this video, I know for a fact you're going to love this one. Be sure to click on it right here.